I've been on Lily Card for a little over a year and only very close family members and friends know about it because it is embarrassing. I mean, I don't want to ask for help from anybody. I grew up in a family where you work hard for what you get. And I never wanted to ask for help for anything, but I needed it. Juice, milk. When I go to the grocery store and I ring it through the credit card machine, I hold my fingers over it so people don't, you know, say it's a link card. That one? Rachel Bride's a mom, a nursing student, and supporting her family with two jobs. I got the second job to help catch up on bills that I was getting behind on that I wasn't able to afford with just one job. Mm -hmm. So I got the second job, and then when I reported having my second job, it put me $35 over the limit for having the link card. Rachel says in her case, quitting the second job to keep her link membership would be more beneficial than keeping both jobs. She says it's a backwards deal. After going to the public aid office in Macomb this last week and being treated so horribly, I decided enough. That, that sy the system of public aid was designed for people like me, people that work, people that go to school, people that need help. Their mission statement says that they're there for support to help gain stability in your life. That stability is what I need to use while I'm going through school until I can get a job where I can financially afford everything on my own. Rachel says she knows there are people who abuse the system, but there are many more who don't. There are people that are different. There's people that need it, people that use it for what it was designed for. Two hands. Everyone needs help sometime in their life, some in different forms, not necessarily link card or medical cards. Sometimes it's in different forms. I don't think you should be ashamed of it, and I'm not ashamed of it anymore. Brooke Hash, KHQA News, Macomb.